What's up guys, hope you're having an amazing day. Today my tutorial video is gonna be how to outline yourself in your thumbnail. I've been making lots of tutorial videos and my last one is actually going crazy right now. It's getting a couple hundred views per day, how to watch Netflix with your friends. So if you wanna check that out, I will put that down below if you're interested in that. I'm only showing you guys on the iPad because it's bigger and easier for me to use, but you can get this exact same app on your phone. So yeah, let's get started with this thumbnail thing. So yeah, the first thing I need to do is get a thumbnail for you guys. So all right guys, I'm on my iPad right now and the first thing you wanna do is download an app called PicArt. It's the third app from the right on the very bottom of the screen. It looks like that. So I'm gonna click that and open it up. Waiting for it to load. Press X on that. The first thing you wanna do is press the plus in the middle of the thing. And then you pick out what thumbnail you want. So I'm gonna pick out the one that I took for this video. It's just me and holding my iPad. And the next thing you want to do is actually look at the bottom of the screen. You see a whole bunch of different things you can do. You want to go six over and press the one that says cut out. It has a picture of scissors on it. And then after you do that, you want to look at the bottom of the screen. There should be a little person thing. So you click that and it should do a little bit for you. It should highlight it red. So as you can see, it highlighted it a little bit red. So you want to fill in all the spots that it didn't highlight. You can zoom in and do anything you want. Just make sure you get every single spot that you want to be inside the outline. Make sure you get it real nice and good. The more, the more time you take on this, the better it's gonna turn out. As you guys can see, everything is highlighted. So the next thing you do is go to the top and you press save. So it looks like that. You press next. Actually, you don't press next. You go back on the top left arrow and press save draft. So now you open up the very same picture that you went to before, the original thumbnail, and you press add photo. It's the eighth one from the left. And the photo that you wanna add is the one that you just saved with the white background. Then you press add one photo. And you should see this, you can move it around, it's just yourself with nothing behind it. So then you make that bigger until it fits yourself. Then you line it up perfectly. Just like that. And then at the bottom of the screen, you see border and you press border. So then it looks like that. You can press whatever color you want for the border. And then for the amount, you definitely want to go down a little bit from 20. So as you can see, it borders it just like you want for the thumbnails to get a better looking, more professional thumbnail. And as you can see, I didn't outline it good enough. That's why you can tell there's a little bit in between me and the, the white outline. But yeah, if you just take your time on the highlighting yourself, it's going to look a lot better than this. And then after I do all of this, you press apply. Normally to make my thumbnails look better, I go to effect. And if I'm outside, I always do HDR. It just makes it look a lot better when you're outside, but I don't do that for inside. You can do whatever you want. So yeah, that's how you outline yourself in a thumbnail.